prime me Nissan. <laughs> I am still recovering from <laughs> last episode, but welcome back to the channel. It's me, Abby Kareen, <laughs> your friendly neighborhood nerd who has a uh, trauma now. <laughs> um, we're back with cyberpunk edge runners. <laughs> This is episode seven called Stronger. I do not feel strong. I feel weak. I feel I feel sad. <laughs> we lost Maine. We lost Dorio. Kiwi's off. Probably not gonna return. I don't know. I'm just like pretty upset with that whole situation. Um, you know, at least he still has Lucy. The one of the biggest takeaways though that I don't think I taught well no, I did talk about it. Um, but out of last episode is Faraday. Like we knew Faraday was shady. Like they're all Tanaka's just as shady, but it's just like there's more to it, whatever this is. And I just don't want there to be any more pain. <laughs> I just want David and Lucy just like be together, go to go to the moon, colonize. I don't know. No, don't colonize. Don't colonize nothing. But like go on the moon and get some jobs over there and just like chill. How do we get to that? Take Rebecca with you, please. <laughs> but I'm just stalling. I'm delaying because I just don't want there to be any more suffering. But we're going to jump in and just see, I guess, where Lucy and David are after the aftermath, after losing. <sighs> I'm not going to cry. We're going to jump in. <laughs> but after losing Maine and Dorio, we're going to see how they do and like what what's their next plan. So we'll jump in and not cry, <laughs> right? This is my last show, so if I do cry, it's all right. But I just, I just, I don't want there to be no more suffering. Whew. Are, these are also edge runners. Oh, she was a new... Oh, no. Is it a new crew? Yeah, yeah, boy. <laughs> Stupid. Can he zip up his jacket? He looks so good. <laughs> And, okay, we did a little time skip. Okay. David. Okay, so is that, was that also Kiwi up there? Are they, is everyone back? Sweet, he's so sad. He is so mature now. He had to grow up. He had to grow up after Maine. He looks so good. Where's Lucy? Yeehaw. Oh, he's like some southern, no, western twink. This is crazy. First of all, David is not a baby. Love. This crew is so, jeez, yes, those arms look good. Or is it just arm? <laughs> bang, 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 bang. <laughs> oh, nice. Good job, Kiwi. She's doing great. Relax, dude. Just let him, yeah, has it been, yeah, how's it, how, oh, new hand. This is not okay. Is he older now? Can I like officially just be like, ugh, Jesus. Oh, he grew up. Nice, Jesus. He, that guy was moving very fast for that. Jeez. Love it. This, he... I have no words for David. He's, he's dead. Dead. That's what happens. Yeah. Yeah. Icarus flew too high. Wow, good on him. He's got his business going just fine. Like, oh my God. She is so like her brother. I absolutely love it. <laughs> Thank you, I just imagined this guy to just have like, always have a bottle of whiskey and like a glass ready. 
Oh, yeah, and I think May knew that too. Love it. Okay, so he's, where's Lucy? Oh. Oh, oh, after, well, that, I mean, again, it was traumatic. And, and she saw something in Tanaka's files, I feel like, right? God damn. Jesus, they did not have to draw David this good. Oh my gosh, how's the doctor doing? <laughs> I know, get him on the dance floor. You. I, is... This actually makes me a little worried because he isn't, he's like kind of losing his humanity. I have, I have concerns with him getting this. Wow. 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 But they just lose their humanity. Oh, this, does this not bode well for David in the end? Yeah. And what do you want? Offer him some scotch. Yeah. Yeah, well, you got Maine killed. No, he didn't. <laughs> I would not be having conversations with this man. I don't know. Oh. Oh. Bum, bum. Okay, I just don't think, oh man, I don't know guys. I know that David didn't know about Fair Day really. Well, she's... Yeah, and we're not going to force her. No. No, no, no. See, no. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Nope. If I... <laughs> He's really taking this job, never mind. <laughs> okay. Okay. And I know this is, this is good for him and his business, but see, he's just so shady. <sighs> He's just so shady. What a beautiful place. Good yeah. job, David. Oh, they are together. Oh, but she's just, she's just not going. Okay. Wow. Sorry. There's so much to take. <laughs> I just need a little more time. Aww. Of course. Sis. I love her tattoo. That'd be a nice tattoo. This is a really, this is a really soft moment. I really appreciate this. We're going for a ride. I love this. I'm glad that, okay. I was worried that she was like not talking to him, but like they're, they're good. I've never been outside of the city before. Is that right? But you have had a life outside that city once. I need to look up this artist. This is just so fabulous. I'd like to know more about you. Yeah. You guys seem like you support each other pretty well, so. Oh, wow. That's really sad. That's really sad. Very Akira right here. Wild. Wow. So this kind of turned into a Blade Runner. Oh. Jeez. I'm so sad. Oh my god. <laughs> no wonder 
if she doesn't want to talk about that shit. I guess, girl. Yeah. I, I'm, I gotta breathe. I gotta, this episode is. Jesus Christ, this is the saddest origin story. Oh, Lucy. Oh. God, this is really sad. Maybe I used to be scared. It's not. Stop. Yeah. Yeah, seriously. Oh my god, I can't. <laughs> I can't process this right now. I mean, I can't, but. Yeah. Try and hug her, comfort her. Okay. So, is that going to be someone hunting runners? Is this like a runner hunter? Hunter runner? Okay, this is the longest pant, Jesus. Yeah? Error. Is she attacking him? Jesus. Out of commission, that one. Dark Lucy. Boom, boom. This is an episode to process. Like, I have to definitely see if I can break this down. Um, okay, first of all, David, with this, with this glow up, with this chrome up, I'll just be moaning a lot from now on, and I apologize. You're probably going to have to deal with it for three more episodes, but goddamn. <laughs> he looks good. He looks fabulous. Um, however, I am upset because he's losing his humanity, I feel like. And like what Lucy said kind of hit the nail on the head, where it's just like you're chasing someone else's dream, and it is Maine's. Like, while I, I'm happy David has ambitions, like sometimes there's a line that you have to put there for yourself. And I don't think he has that quite yet. Like he's not doing crazy, terrible things or anything, but like to work with Faraday. And again, I understand that David does not know the, truly the interactions between Maine and Faraday. And, but, and, 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 you know what we know more that Faraday seems like a shady ass man than David. So it's just like, I, I get that we have a bias perspective here, but it's just, uh, I don't know. Actually, I just stopped my own argument there because it's just like, you know, David is going to go into this blind. He doesn't know who Faraday is. So it's just like, how could he know? He's just trying to, you know, become more, be more. And he is. And like, I'm happy for him. But man, I don't know. I feel like going, working for like, is it Militech or, or even um, Arasaka? I'm just sorry, I'm just learning these names. Um, but like, I feel like working for anything with those two companies just seems like a bad deal. It's, that's a bad take. And I, I just, so, you know, the other stuff he's been, the other stuff he's been doing is great. Like working with the, I think it's the Waka, Wakawa, um, like that stuff. Sure. Why not? But like, you don't have to, you don't have to go crazy. <laughs> I guess that's what it is. I don't know. I feel like he's about to be Icarus and flying too close to the sun, like chasing that, chase, chasing that chrome. Cause like he is very into that and like his arm shaking. Is he just gonna, is he gonna glitch out and it's gonna be a tragic scene? And then I'm also worried about my girl Lucy because that last scene where she's like, whoosh, dark Lucy has entered the chat room. I'm living for it. But like at the same time, I'm, I'm still trying to, I guess, make sense of that last scene. Cause I don't know if that guy who just died is like a runner hunter. Um, and if he worked for Arasaka to f potentially find her, cause like they were just like, you know, there's only a certain amount of people who could do this kind of job. And I, I don't know. Cause they know she escaped. 
So they have record of her. So I don't know if they're hunting her specifically or just like he was checking on all the other runners and she just happened to like find him and, and kill him. So like there's still a couple of questions. I might rewatch that scene again, honestly. Um, or I'm sure it will be answered more, but it's just like, but she's always on the run after that fucking sad pass. I, her pass. I want to give that girl a hug and an ice cream cone. It's just ridiculous. What a terrible life that girl has lived. And just like to constantly be in fear of like them finding her. I'm glad she opened up to David though. That was good. That was important. Very necessary. I'm hoping... I don't know. I'm just, I'm hoping that he, I mean, he always will have her back. It's just, I think it's good that he knows about this potential threat to her, you know, so he's not like blindsided. So, you know, keeping her safe. I love it. I love that they hug each other and support each other and go on these little bike dates. But again, I think I'm just going to end with just, just please just ignore my thirst because David... Is David and Maine put together? What? I can't, I can't be upset. I can't be mad. <laughs> I can't wait till the next episode. So uh, that's going to be it. So thanks for watching. And I will see you in the next reaction. Bye.